Hi, welcome back to Honest Reactions. I'm Mike. And I'm Derek. And today we're going to be reacting to the 007 Spectre trailer that came out the other day. Which we're super excited about. Right. Uh, We've been painfully not yeah. watching it. Well, I've been jazzed since I saw the first one. Because this shit looks like it's going to be cool as fuck. Alright, well so, let's watch this shit. Let's get to it. Cigarette burn. You had no authority. None. Mexico City. What were you doing there? Shoot, motherfuckers. What else? I was else? taking some overdue holiday. So what's going on, James? They say you're finished. What do you think? I think you're just getting started. Magnificent, isn't she? Zero to 60 in 3.2 seconds. A few little tricks up this day. Do one more thing for me. What do you have in mind? Make me disappear. <laughs> Tell me where he is. He's everywhere. If you go there, you're crossing over to a place where there is no mercy. You're protecting someone. Get away from me! Why should I trust you? Because right now, I'm your best chance of staying alive. This organization, do you know what it's called? Its name is Spectre. And do you know who links them all? Me. Welcome, James. You came across me so many times, yet you never saw me. What took you so long? Is this really what you want? Living in the shadows? Hunting? Being hunted? Always alone? I don't stop to think about it. It was me, James. The author of all your pain. Fuck yeah! Christoph Waltz, man. Yep. I'm sold right there. I <laughs> I knew it was going to get you super excited when I heard that he was going to be the main bad guy in Spectre. Fuck yeah. Yeah. It's, just, yeah. it's No, I, it's my favorite Bond and uh, one of my other favorite actors. Yeah. So, um, yeah. And God, the action looked really cool. The story looks like it's going to be really engaging. Oh, I'm yeah, definitely looking forward yeah, to this. Just, this is going to be cool. What is all the history between Christoph Waltz and James Bond? And yeah, it's going to it's going to be cool. Really yeah. looking forward to this movie. Yeah. yeah. And and I like that they kind of called back to a previous Bond movie, but they're like, "Meh, snowmobiles. How about a fucking seaplane, bitches?" <laughs> Or the, the barrel rolling helicopter, that yeah. looked cool. I don't know if that's realistic or not, but it looked fucking tense. Yeah. It's, yeah, fuck, this is going to be awesome. Yeah. And, and it's, I just, I love Daniel Craig's Bond. I mean, he's, I think we've well, talked about that before yeah. on a regular show. Yeah, everything, everything they have done with a slight miss with Quantum of Solace, or Quantum of Solstice. Quantum of Solace. Solace. Yeah. The, that movie was a slight miss, but other than that, everything they've done... Yeah, Casino Royale, Skyfall, it's... Yeah, it, they've... Has they, been, Daniel Craig's an excellent Bond. Yeah. I absolutely love the guy's work. These are some very cool movies. I mean, this is, this is the coolest that Bond has been in a long time. Yeah. I mean, I, I still like some of the other ones. And, oh, I'm and, not saying some I of wish... the other ones were bad. I liked Pierce Brosnan's uh, early Bond movies. Yeah, he um, just got stuck with some really bad scripts. Yeah, like GoldenEye was really good. Um, 
you know, it's and if you like campy shit, Roger Moore's Bond was fun. Mm. You know, and uh, of course, uh, Sean Connery. Yeah. You know. It's who's commonly considered the man, but to me, Daniel Craig has overtaken him. But yeah. you know, it's good is still awesome. So yeah, what yeah. you know, it's it's when you when you compare those guys as Bond, you're just comparing awesome to awesome. So no matter what, you you're getting a good Bond movie. Yeah, or at least you got a good shot at getting a good Bond movie. This one looks fucking excellent. Yeah, well, it looks like it's gonna have a. You, a great villain. Yeah. And when you have a great villain, it generally tends to make it into a good movie. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's heroes tend to be judged by their villains. Mm-hmm. You know. So, uh, yeah, wow, it was fucking awesome. Totally got to see this. Uh, so, thanks for coming by. Uh, you guys have a good day. Join us here again for our next Honest Reaction. Oh, right. <laughs> I'm sorry, I forgot about our gimmick. <laughs>